Hello world, I'm LJ and this is LJ Goes Sweden. It's the national day in Sweden. So what is the best to do for this day? Well, we're checking out a song from Finland. <laughs> and this is the song from Kerie called Cha 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 from the Eurovision Song Contest 2023. If you're just here to see my reaction, Check out the timestamp to skip forward because right now I'm talking about my daily life as always. So yes, you see me again sitting on this couch. This is a common theme now on this channel. I just didn't feel like doing anything today. And not because I was like, oh yeah, I'm lazy and I want to chill at home. No, because my body told me, walking, nah, that's not a good thing. Take a painkiller and hope it's getting better. Well, I did. And it is okay-ish. It is unfortunately not as good as on Tuesday when I took the first time painkiller in a long time. Luckily, tomorrow my medication will arrive. I will pay it. I will take it. And then it's going uphill, hopefully. Yeah, we will see how it goes. What did I do today? Well, I watched a lot of documentaries about different things. For example, a, a Swedish one where people went onto an island that is not really inhabited anymore, but there are still a few people left. <laughs> Unfortunately, I nearly fell asleep during that thing. It was an hour ago. And before that, I watched a lot of German documentaries about, I don't know, some buildings and politics and history. Ah, yeah, I don't know. Today was really a really, really lazy day too. Not only because I could not really make too much, but I just, yeah, enjoyed it because it was an additional off day. Yesterday, I can also say that there was a meeting that I had after work. It was going an hour and it was not really that useful. It was talking about the current AI situation, but it basically was like an introduction and I just felt like I have already used AI last year during my master's thesis time when it was all coming up and I was just fascinated by it. So I tried everything, programming, writing stories, generating images and, and now they show me like how to write a prompt and I was like, you're kidding me, right? But yeah, I just felt like I'm not the target group during that work meeting. But it was at least somewhat interesting to see what you can do with the AI. Besides this, I have not done anything on this national day so far. I don't really know what is what is a typical thing Swedish people do during the national day. I should have checked maybe. There's probably some events going on in town. But next year it's my time to take all the positive things during the holidays. Yeah, we will see, we will see. <laughs> but I'm very optimistic, to be honest. I really am. But now, enough said. Let's switch to a different country, my neighbor country, Finland, and just see what Kerie is showing us right now. Let's go. Okay, guys, it is time to go back in history to last year's Eurovision Song Contest. We are watching Kerie's performance the song called Cha Cha Cha. It was the fan favorite. Everyone, yeah, in the audience was kind of surprised that Lorene actually won. Well, she received basically all the jury points and Kerie was definitely the hella voting favorite. Unfortunately, it was not enough. For me, both Lorene and Kerie deserved the win. Actually, however, Kerie would have been my first pick. So for today, I will be watching the grand final performance of the song. I remember, because this was my first real Eurovision Song Contest that I followed in detail, I have not really liked the song just from the Spotify version. And I was like, how can someone like that? How can this be a fan favorite? And then I saw the semi-final performance and I was like, wow, that is amazing. Okay, but enough said, let's watch this grand final performance. <laughs> the green what what is the green thing called that he's wearing because it is really really yeah a gimmick that makes him special and like i don't know the lyrics i actually tried to sing this song in karaoke with my friends it's so hard Cha, 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 cha. 
this whole stage performance is really great. Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah, that was the that was the important part. He nearly hit himself with this one wire rope when he is running around this chest. I remember that. I was like, that was close. Cha 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 cha. I actually don't really like this beginning part too much, but compared to the thing we were receiving right now, it is totally worth it. Everything is turning green. And then we have this kind of human centipede thing. <laughs> And there we go. It really looks cool with all the rainbow color, like all the colors. Oh man, it really gave me goosebumps. Oh, okay. <laughs> this is such a special performance. And like, if I would have to rank the people that I know from the Eurovision Song Contest, he is definitely the most charismatic one. I don't know, like, I remember this whole voting thing when Finland got votes and how how happy he was, how crazy he got. It's awesome. And it's kind of sad that Jos Klein from the Netherlands this year got disqualified because they also seemed really to connect well with each other because they did some yeah, Instagram posts together. So I think these two put them together in one song in the future. I will be reacting to this if it's happening. And I'm really, really hoping it will happen. It could be hilarious seeing them both on the same stage at the same time. Okay, but this is Kerie Cha Cha Cha. What did you guys think back in time when you were watching your Eurovision Song Contest? Did you think like, oh yeah, this song has to win? Or did you just think like, oh no, that's just some Finnish crazy performance, but it should not really get too much attention? And also, if you have never listened to this song, what do you think from it hearing it for the first time? Because singing wise yeah this is not really something too crazy but it's just the whole story and carrier in the middle having this huge charisma carrying the crowd with this song and that is it for today i hope you had a wonderful day we're going to see each other back in tomorrow's video but for now it's time to say goodbye see you later <laughs>